Pamela writes, the trees seem exceptionally brilliant this year. I've been wondering what might have made conditions right for such bright, brilliant colors. Ellen, she's right about this. They're unbelievable. Oh my goodness. An example given right here. This is a scene from Allegan this year. Vibrant reds, beautiful yellows and golds. So we saw these color conditions this year because of the weather conditions. Remember, every year the daylight fades at the same speed through the year, astronomically, that never changes. So what does change year to year is of course the weather conditions week to week and the weather conditions leading into the fall foliage display. So for great fall color, here's what you need. You need average moisture. So not too much, not too little. We don't want drought, we don't want a deluge. We want average moisture levels. We also want warm days and cool, crisp nights. If we can get that combination, we get the most vibrant colors across the board. So the science behind fall foliage shows that warmer temperatures usually mute our colors. Cooler temperatures really help to signal to the trees to stop the chlorophyll production and go into fall mode. Luckily for us, we saw really uniform conditions of when we saw the cooler temperatures and we didn't see a hard frost. So all the trees transitioned at the same time. In fact, if we look at October and we slice it in half here, temperatures for the first half of October trended about three degrees cooler than average. Again, cooler is good for fall foliage. The second half of October, trended about five degrees cooler than average. So that really helped to tell the trees it was time to turn. Now the last item of importance, and this is a very important one, is the weather leading into the fall season. Remember 2019, it was one of our worst color displays. Last year was not that great either. Some of that had to do with the groundwater content. 2019 was the wettest year on record. It also was helping to come off the wettest three year and five year span on record. Tree roots go a good six feet deep in some cases. So if you have a lot of groundwater, that can also help to mute the colors and delay the show. Bottom line, we had the perfect setup and we had the perfect show this year.